Hidden Figures Chapter 4 The Double V Summary or Main Points For more videos on the same topic, please subscribe my channel, Learners on Board. Setting and Characters Setting 1943 Newport News City Main Idea In pursuit of a stable career, Dorothy arrives at Newport News, which is a booming military hub. She observes strict Jim Crow laws at Newport News, which caused confusion among blacks as well as whites. The idea of double victory was articulated by an activist, James Thompson, in his letter to the Pittsburgh, in his letter to the Pittsburgh Courier. Characters Dorothy Vaughan, W.E.B. Du Bois, James Thompson, an activist. Summary or main points. Dorothy Vaughan arrived in the Hampton Roads Harbor of Newport News, which had recently become a powerful military capital. In this town, most of the women were hired for war jobs and several other jobs. This region's civilian population increased significantly from 1940 to 1942 due to immigration, with a tenfold increase in military personnel. The federally funded housing development began in Newport News East End to address the critical shortage of housing for war workers. Migrants waited to rent 5,200 prefabricated demountable houses, of which 1,200 in Newsome Park were designated for blacks and 4,000 in Copeland Park were designated for whites. Dorothy started working at Langley Memorial Aeronautical Laboratory for $5 a week. She got a place to live that was segregated by race. This city's buses and trolleys followed Jim Crow transportation laws, separate but equal, which were confusing for both black and white riders. Due to overcrowded buses and a busy work schedule, it sometimes pushed racial relations to a breaking point. Black and white would mingle. Blacks were fined, subjected to derogatory, humiliating treatment, and faced violence if they violated Jim Crow laws. American Negroes stood against the annihilation happening in Europe against Jews. However, they also identified it within their own country. Discrimination against Black Americans. Executive Order 8802 and the establishment of fair employment practices brought positivity to the Black community. Furthermore, President Woodrow Wilson promised African Americans that they would be granted equal and full citizenship. However, the military forbade Blacks from serving with whites. Slowly and gradually, a few white individuals like Mark Etheridge, a white liberal, made a statement in favor of black people. On the other hand, black people were compelled to ask a question of themselves. What did this war mean for America's 10th man? The concept of double victory, double V, arose from the fissure of their ever-present double consciousness as described by W.E.B. Du Bois. The first V is for the victory over their enemies outside the country. The second victory is for the victory over their enemies within the country. Enemies who are pro-segregation between whites, between blacks and whites. Dorothy Vaughan headed to the Langley Memorial Aeronautical Laboratory for her first day at work. Now, it's time for quiz. Answer the following questions. Why did African Americans have conflicting feelings during World War II? Question number two. What do you understand by the term double V and who articulated it? Answer one. 
African Americans supported the war effort and were loyal to the US. However, they also struggled with the discrimination they were facing in the United States and could go for excuse me, and could go to foreign lands to make things better when people were suffering in the United States. Answer 2. The first V is for victory over their enemies outside the country. And the second V is for victory over their enemies within the country, enemies who are pro-segregation between blacks and whites. This concept was articulated by James Thompson. Thank you for watching my video. For more videos on the same topic, please subscribe my channel and help my channel grow.